and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you guys my new Calpac luggage set that I just bought from Nordstrom Rack. I'm going back home to the East Coast this July and I didn't have my own luggage set. I don't really do much traveling and whenever I do I always just borrow from whatever my mom has. So I really wanted a hard shell luggage case that had the 360 wheels. And I know I'm super late on this, but I never really had the need or want for it until now. I got the Calpac Zion two-piece luggage set from Nordstrom Rack for $180. It was on sale from $285, and it was a really great deal because it comes with a check-in bag and a carry-on bag. And when I was shopping for it, it only said there were like three left, so I just jumped on it and bought it right away. So I don't think that it's still in stock on Nordstrom Rack, but I'll definitely look online and find some other sites that carry this product. This set is a older model, but it still has the same functionality and aesthetic as the newer styles, and I got it in the silver colorway. Okay, so this is the 22-inch carry-on suitcase, and then this one is the 30-inch check-in suitcase. They both are hard shell, and they have the 360 spinner wheels. That's really smooth. They also have branding on the zippers, uh, branding on the side here, and then both of them have this TSA lock. Both of them also have a top handle and a side handle, and then the one that extends right here. Um, one thing I did notice like right away is that this kind of like is loose. I don't know if you can hear that or see it, but I'm curious to see how it will do once the bag is full, because um, I don't know how sturdy it is, but I guess I'll just have to test it out and let you guys know afterwards. I really like the fact that it has the TSA lock. That gives me a sense of security and safety when I'm traveling. And I actually haven't set this up yet, so let's do that now. Um, on here, there is a tab that says how to set your TSA lock with CalPAC. Uh, number one, set dials to default code 000. Number two, push pen to push bottom button in and then remove the pen. Number three, turn dials to set your desired code. Number four, push top button down. Number five, bottom button will now release and then your code is now set. Also on here, there's a tab that says that there's a two year limited warranty. Um, I'll just read it really quickly. This Calpac product carries a two year limited warranty to the original purchaser against defects in material and workmanship for two years from the original date of purchase. If, defect if defective, this product will be repaired or replaced with the same or similar product at the discretion of Calpac. So it's really nice that it has a two year warranty so if anything happens or if this is damaged in any way, I can reach out to either Nordstrom Rack or Calpac themselves. Okay, so now that we set up the locks on both of these suitcases, let's open them up and see what they look like inside. Okay, so let's open up the carry-on luggage first. So inside there's a Calpac branded interior. And then on the left side, there's Calpac branding up at the top here with this leather patch. Um, there's two pockets here in the front as well as a zipper mesh pouch here. And then a full-on zipper that is the whole area of the suitcase that has more storage area on the bottom. And then in the middle, there's this zipper pouch here where you can store some other small items. And then on the right side, there's another compartment with an elastic strap belt. Oh, and then on the inside of this mesh bag, there's the key that I think we were supposed to use for the TSA lock, but I just used a regular pen, so I guess that works too, but you could also use the this item that it comes with. So for the carry-on, it does expand to be bigger. Um, I'll show you real quick what it looks like when it's expanded. Now let's open up the check-in suitcase. So this suitcase is just a bigger version of the carry-on suitcase that I just showed. I actually want to test out how to how to relock it. Let's see how that goes. Let me see. I just put the code in and then it opened right away. And then you put these um, zipper pulls inside them to like lock it in. But I suggest you to put it on the side here so that it's easier to put them both in at the same time. Once they're fully in there and locked in there, then you then it then these uh, 
numbers move so you can kind of relock it and just like switch around the numbers. Um, but that was really difficult. I just tried like four times to do that. Um, just hold it down and then I suggest you do both of them at the same time and just make sure that when you release the button at the top that the thing like goes through the hole. I don't know if that makes sense, but if you have this and you'll see it and you'll know what I'm talking about. Okay, cool. So it's locked and ready to go. So this concludes this video. I am super happy with my purchase. I love the style of this luggage set and especially the hard shell casing because it'll protect everything when I'm traveling and definitely the TSA lock is a great addition too. I'll leave the link of the product page in the description box down below as well as other sites that carry this product online and alternatives for you guys to shop. Uh, let me know in the comments down below what brand of luggage you guys use or where you guys are traveling to. I'd love to learn more about you guys that are watching this video. Also, don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you in the next one. Thank you for watching.